huge Harvestman arachnids attacking Seattle to a 20-ton spider crawling down a building. Here are 14 giant spiders explained. Damn, nature, you scary. Number 14. Do-it-yourself spider. It seems like humongous spiders love crawling around our domiciles. Well, here's another one. And it looks as if the arachnid took the ladder to reach the roof. But the massive 20-foot creature is actually a fabrication. And one which you can make for yourself if you like. We found this curious construct along with instructions on how to make it at instructables.com. This massive spider measures more than 30 feet high and 33 feet wide. Now, it's actually a statue made of bronze, marble, and stainless steel and was created by artist Louise Bourgeois. It's so detailed that it even contains a sack with 26 eggs made out of marble and its thorax and abdomen are crafted from ribbed bronze. Editions of this sculpture called Mamo, the French word for mother, are on display at various art galleries around the world. Japanese spider crab. Yes, we are talking about giant spiders, but we are going to stretch things a bit with this decapod crustacean. It's the Japanese spider crab, and it has the largest leg span of any arthropod, reaching five and a half meters from claw to claw and weighs over 40 pounds. Okay, fine, it's not an arachnid, but it sure does look like a scary giant spider, right? That's why it makes the list. This picture of a huge wolf spider on an electricity meter in Australia went viral. If for no other reason, then the very sight is enough to give you the creepy crawlies. Now, it's not just the spider, it's the hundreds of baby spiders seen crawling throughout the image. You can see how the babies cover the meter's dials while the adult's legs obscure the digital screen. Wolf spiders are venomous and have a painful bite, but are not considered lethal. Although, seeing this picture seemed to threaten the well-being of anyone who encountered it online. Did you ever wonder what might happen if scientists used alien microbes to make tomato plants grow exponentially larger, only to find out there was a spider egg in the way? Well, that spider would grow into a gargantuan beast and would start tearing down buildings and generally laying waste to the city, as you can see. The lesson? Always keep your alien microbes to yourself. The inspiring story was told in a 2013 movie called Mega Spider which is where we found this image. Arachnids in the mist. This enormous creature was spotted in the UK during a particularly foggy morning, obviously. Just look at how huge the spider appears in contrast to the dogs in the background. It certainly looks convincing, and yet it is actually a wicker model made by a company called Topiary Art Designs in Suffolk. This wicker sculpture measures around nine feet tall and more than 30 feet wide. Now we found this image while researching online. We know that the picture is from the UK and was posted to Facebook by Nicole Heron. It appears to be an impressively sized khaki-colored arachnid that is perhaps lodged in a windowsill. Well, what kind of spider do you think this is? Just take a look at this monstrous creature. It appears to be scaling the wall of a building in southwestern Russia. When the clip was posted to YouTube, it attracted two million views within a week, with many believing the clip was the real thing. But it turned out to be the work of a graphic designer named Dmitry Kataev. He was apparently bored and decided to place the homemade monster onto a video clip, making it appear as if it was filmed on a mobile phone. Did it have you convinced? Huge house spiders invade homes in the UK every year. The arachnids can grow to 12 centimeters wide, but despite the name, they usually live outdoors. They're found from Europe to Northern Asia and North America. Warm weather tends to accelerate the growth of these spiders, and males will migrate indoors to mate with females at the end of summer. Britons, in particular, tend to take the creatures in stride, even referring to them as golden retrievers. The spider's bite can be similar to a bee sting if the skin is pierced, but that's unlikely if the spiders aren't antagonized. 
Did you know that in 2012, Seattle found itself under attack by giant spiders? In the pictures, you can see how the huge harvestmen arachnids climbed up and over buildings in the city. Now, if you missed that news flash, well, that's because it never happened. The massive creatures were actually the work of Marlon Peterson. He's an artist who specializes in trompe an art style that makes two-dimensional images appear to be 3D when viewed from certain angles. In these pictures, you can see that the 2100 square foot image looks like a painting when viewed standing on the roof. But when viewed from a higher angle, the creatures become truly menacing and quite lifelike. Did you think the arachnids were real at first? You may have seen this image of a gigantic Hawaiian cane spider on the side of a house making the rounds online. It purports to display a creature that can grow up to six feet across and sent arachnophobes into apoplectic fits. But not to worry, as our friends over at Snopes.com explained, this creature was the result of some digital trickery on the part of a gentleman named Paul Santa Maria. He even provided a picture to Snopes that shows the original evidence of a wolf spider that was literally blown out of proportion. Portion. And FYI, cane spiders do exist, but the bodies are around an inch long. Huge Huntsman Spider. Chances are you've seen this image on social media. It's said to be the biggest Huntsman Spider ever photographed, which is really saying something as the creatures can have a leg span up to 30 centimeters. Pictures of this arachnid were first taken in 2015 at an animal rescue farm in the Brisbane Valley of Queensland. Apparently, this big critter is for real, but as menacing as they may appear, the creatures are not considered dangerous to healthy humans, although their venom can cause swelling, vomiting, and irregular heartbeat. Did you know a 20-ton spider was caught crawling down the side of a Liverpool office building? Well, no need to rush for a can of raid, or a bazooka for that matter. The arachnid is actually a real-life construct made of steel and wood, and measures around 15 meters high and 20 meters across. It takes 12 people strapped onto its frame to operate the enormous spider. The mechanism is said to have 50 axes that enable it to move very much like a real arachnid. The scary looking creature was part of a five day piece of street theater and was later scheduled to crawl about the city as part of celebrating the capital of culture year. Did you ever hear about the huge spider found roaming about the South American rainforest in 2014? Now here's the thing, it was said to be the size of a puppy. The photos look like something out of a Photoshop fever dream. But as we fact checked our research with Snopes.com, it turns out those claims are real. It was actually the South American Goliath bird-eating tarantula. Just look at how huge this creature appears to be. The photos were taken by an entomologist named Piotr Neskraki, who encountered the animal while exploring the rainforest. As you might expect, this is the world's biggest spider, as measured by mass anyway. They can weigh over six ounces and grow to one foot in body length. But it seems to look even bigger in the pictures. Did you know these creatures are kept as pets around the world? Damn, nature, you scary.